now that winter is almost here, you need to get your hands on CeraVe Healing Ointment. With winter, everywhere it's cold, the air is dry, sucking up all the moisture from our skin, resulting in dry, cracked skin, chapped lips, and sometimes when people's skin tends to peel. This is due to transepidermal water loss. What is so good about this product? It is an occlusive, so basically it prevents water from leaving the skin. It contains ingredients like petroleum, ceramide, hyaluronic acid, vitamin B, vitamin E, and so on. From my experience, as winter progresses, our skin tends to change. My skin goes from combination to normal, depending on how cold it gets on different days. It could also get very dry so using the healing ointment is my go-to for combating the dryness that winter brings and it helps keep my skin in check this right here is a multi-use or multi-purpose product you can use this on your lips your face your body and even your scalp yes i use it on my scalp you can incorporate this into your morning and night skincare routine at night use this as the last step in your routine to seal up all the skincare products you have applied on or to your face during the day or in your morning routine apply this before sunscreen this can also be mixed with your body lotion or body cream when applying it to your skin right now i'm showing you how this is applied or how i use it over other skincare products during my night routine can you wear makeup over this absolutely it's a good base for makeup hold on let me show you how this works for me so this is what my face looks like after applying the concealer on top or over the CeraVe healing ointment everything has mixed nicely nothing is Breaking. So this right here is my finished look. You guys can see that the CeraVe Healing Ointment pairs very well with complexion products. So the CeraVe Healing Ointment retails for about $8 up depending on the size you get and where you purchase it from. They are only available or these are only available in the US, I don't know why we don't have this yet in Europe. Anyway, if you are in Europe or anywhere in the world and you can't get your hands on the CeraVe, do not stress. We have alternatives like Aquaphor and Vaseline. So either of them would give you the same result. The only difference between these and the CeraVe healing ointment is basically texture and finish so for me i feel like the cerave healing ointment starts of thick but when applied on the skin it melts in so swiftly whereas with vaseline for example this is thick and i can still tell that i have something on my skin with aquaphor i think the only thing i do not like about it is the smell it's like a lighter version of the vaseline i believe hold on let's see Cerave healing ointment right here is Vaseline and right here is the Aquaphor. If you look closely, you would see that the Cerave healing ointment is already turning to oil. That's it at the bottom right there. So I really do like it a lot. So here's what they look after being blended in. I don't know if you guys can see here is the Cerave healing ointment here is vaseline and here is aquaphor so that's pretty much it for this video the cerave healing ointment is a winter essential and should be on everyone's radar i hope you found this video helpful if you did please give it a thumbs up share it subscribe down below if you aren't subscribed already and i'll see you guys in my next one Bye guys, thank you so much for watching and do have a wonderful day.